What up everybody, I just got back from holiday. However, while I was on holiday, I was messaged by Zippel, who told me the new number one Panthera Onka AK-47 from the Ancient Collection had been crafted. Now normally I would be really happy for the guy, yay, new number one. However, prior to going on holiday, I had invested about $3,500 in all of the ancient skins needed to create the new number one. So as soon as I got back, I had to check the flow. The current number one AK-47 Panthera Onka is 0 7 With all the items that I collected, I am hoping to craft an even better flow Panthera Onka 0 0 5 As you can see, I put all of the items in this dummy trade-up contract and seems to think I have about a 41% chance of hitting it, which for me and trade-up contracts, it's pretty damn good. And I'm interested if I just use the 10 items from the ancient collection, whether it would be a better float than the current 0.00076, whereas the current is 0.00074. So there's no way I can do this best odds contract for the 50-50 because it still wouldn't hit the number one. So I'm gonna have to mix some other crazy items in there as well and that means I don't just have one shot at this I should have two shots at it now normally I do like warm-up trade-ups this time I'm just gonna hop straight into it first things first I need to make sure I'm putting in all the right items with the right floats because if I mess up even a single item then it's gonna mess up the contract even if I manage to get the Panthera Onka terrible memories of minimal wear stat track fire surfers it's minimal it's not minimal wear is it minimal wear oh my god but depending on how risky I want to make it I could even craft 420. I could get the 420. I, 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 we need to do that now. It's only a 33.33 reoccurring percent chance, obviously a third, which is less than I had originally planned for. But seeing this float, I can't say no. So after having checked the floats and double checked them and triple checked them, this is what the contract's going to look like, which gives us 33.33% Panthera Onka, 33.33% Run and Hide. This would really suck. If it hit the Ancient Collection and then picked the wrong item, that would really, really suck. Would actually that be the number one P90 Run and Hide? It might be. I'm going to check that. And the answer to that is no. It wouldn't even be the number one. So if we hit this, that would suck. We, of course, also have the 20% at the R8 Amber Fade. Absolutely terrible. I don't think I need to tell you guys that. And the P250 Franklin, also absolutely terrible. So we got two thirds to hit from the Ancient Collection, one third to get the item we want. And if we manage to hit the Panthera Onka, it's gonna be the 420. All there is to do now is count it down and hit this proceed button. Is it gonna be a huge waste $3,500? Let's find out in three, in two, in one. Please show me a Pantera Onka. Yes! Let's go! Let's go! Number one, Pantera Onka. 420, that is absolutely huge. 420? 420. We did it. <laughs> we did it. That's so, so sick. 33% coming in. Absolutely massive. <laughs> I am. I'm super happy with that. That's so good. 33%. Very happy for it. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. It's so, so good. And it's for the 421 as well. But it doesn't stop there. We actually have another shot at possibly creating the number two Panthera Onka. And ooh, 0.0074. I'm not actually sure the second contract is even worth doing because if we manage to hit the Panthera Onka for the second time in a row, which is highly improbable, we will get 0.0007448, which doesn't actually beat the number two Panthera Onka. So we'd be crafting the number three Panthera Onka. And that's just not my stuff. I think I might just save the remaining ancient items that are incredibly low float for a future trade-up video because 
this has gone <laughs> as, as well as it possibly could with the 420 Panthera Onka and it's just going to go downhill from here. I'm, I'm not going to push my luck. There's just no need for it, especially if I'm not even crafting the number one anymore because I've already done it. So if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to slap a like on it. If you have any more suggestions for any uh, number one float skins that you'd like to see me attempt to craft, then please let me know down below in the comments. I do read all the comments and maybe I will actually do the highest rated one. So let me know. I think it's time to go celebrate the Panthera Onka and possibly contact some Chinese collectors, see if they're interested in it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take it easy. Peace. <laughs> I did it! 33% nailed it. Why are you always so lucky? I know, why am I always so lucky?